just as a fun flying yeah. and free flight retro kind of. Yep. It is one. You've got what's that? The rudder bug. No, just, um, we're not far off. Bugaboo. Bugaboo. Yeah. That's a small version of it, isn't it? Yeah. I can't well, find that thing. It's an original bugaboo design. Mm. And they, I think he, he did do one. I guess it's the same fellow did that. I mean, the rudder bug. That's a really funny design to have a thing in town. What's it? What's this like? My father used to fly and fly like, and they were. We could eat to trim them out so he'd land at his feet. But we were not to trim them out. The trouble is these days the wind is usually blowing. Down the coast it is, yeah. Yeah, I think it's a problem. Yeah? Let's see how the old girl performs. <laughs> the prop is not getting any more <laughs> unbent. <laughs> it's not, is it? It's wobbling a bit. So we won't <laughs> wind it up too quick in case it makes an exit. There she is, chaps. <laughs> <She's up. laughs> it's all that rolling about is me because it doesn't really want much rudder. Yeah. In fact, she doesn't like a lot of rudder at all. Because it's, I think I made it a bit big. It prefers its left hand circles now. Then he'll turn left hand there, hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. Now I should be able to get it to a position where I can leave it to itself. Yeah. And we are now in free flight mode. <laughs> <laughs> can speak. Hands off mode, shall we say. But he can come down a bit, actually. It's drifting this way a little bit. So. What tools do you need, Paul? Some spanner. Mm. Um, Sp if you have a look in my little black pouch inside the bag there. Adjustable one. Ah. <laughs> I might be able to undo it by hand, actually. <laughs> Like a long, long stream, I keep running towards a dream, moving on, moving on. Like a branch on a tree, I keep reaching to be free, moving on. No hands. Take your hands away. Okay, I believe you. <laughs> Oops, now I don't film that bit. <laughs> it went a bit too near the nose line, though, isn't it? It's very, very, it rolls a lot when this all the DR dihedra, I suppose, as well. Yeah. It kind of, when it does go into a tight turn, it. Well, uh, you know, it's just, you shouldn't do that, so. Get weary from the
<laughs> yeah, no, no elevator. Oh, no. But, of course, that's all nice and springy. Right. Albeit it's a bit knock kneed now. It, uh, it works. <laughs> nice one. Lovely.
Lovely. Don't stay up longer than you need to for me. Well, I'm not sure how long it'll do to go. If I just said 10 as an hour, should we think of I think it would do a few more. On the other hand. To the, oh, lash yeah. into the main brace or anything? Whatever you like, um, but afterwards. <laughs> this is, uh, there's about a 65 mile an hour wind. At least. At least. And Paul's managed to have a very good flight. And now I'm going to fly my Firebird two channel, which I often fly in this condition, and we'll let you know how we get on. <laughs> Pathetic that you lot haven't turned up. Look, what's everybody here, except us. <laughs> a little bit of a breeze, and nobody comes. <laughs> 